I wish that he was more respectful. I wish that he showed his love more. I wish that he... I'm happy that I at least have something because growing up, I didn't. And that's not fair. Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel, Tough Topic. My name is Brittany. I hope everyone is enjoying their day so far and we all know how frustrating it can be to sit back and watch these sister wives tell alls and the right questions are not being asked. Well, we definitely can't depend on TLC producers for that, but we can count on one of the Brown kids to give us a bit more than what we usually get. And tonight, Christine and Cody's daughter, McKelty, gave us a full roast of information pertaining to the status of relationships and her thoughts on the tell-all. So listen, I know it has to be super hard for the Brown's kids to watch these episodes because... Let's face it, no child wants to hear their parent call them or their siblings jerks, bullies, nasty. McKelty says that they don't watch the shows, only she and Gwen watch. But the viewers were asking some really great questions, and surprisingly, she didn't just float over the question as if she didn't see them like she normally does. She answers with dignity. The first question that really stood out to me was, do you think Cody was wrong by saying... He never loved the other wives. And she states that she feels that he's not being truthful or honest about that because he's just wanting to rewrite history. She says that he thought they were in love and she saw nothing but kindness come from him towards the moms when she was little. So she also says that, and when he met Robin, it was different. Another thing that McKelty mentioned that was really interesting was the whole scene when Cody describes that other wives and the kids have been doing nothing but trash talking when he's done the very same thing. So McKelty says that she doesn't feel like her dad has the right to trash talk anyone because she said it just doesn't make sense. She says that the other moms are not trash talking. They're actually just venting and he takes it as they're just trash talking him. I also wondered myself if Cody is aware of the things he is saying about his kids in efforts to, I don't know, rekindle things or, you know, make things better. But McKelty said it's only making things worse, which we all seen that from the outside looking in. I mean, you can't go on TV and call your kids jerks and expect them to actually want to have a relationship with you. McKelty said no. That's not happening. So thankfully the boys don't watch the show, but I'm pretty sure they see clips or snippets of what he's saying. They're not stupid. McKelty says that she thinks that it's gross that he treats Christine, Janelle, and Mary the way that he does. This is her mom's we're talking about, specifically Christine. Now imagine sitting back, you have a dad, they're, he's divorced from your mom but he's saying all these nasty, foul things that are untrue. How would you feel? You know what I mean? And McKelty, she's actually taking it like a champ, but she does get really emotional in a couple of other topics that were brought up. That might try at least to look at my family um, through the most positive light I can. So McKelty does have a breakdown in one of the questions. A commenter did compliment her and kind of, uh, I guess you could say insult her all in the same sentence, but they said that they appreciate her coming on here. She's, you know, a beautiful, great person. However, they think that she's naive. So McKelty says that she doesn't want to do anything but look at her dad in the most positive light. She says, I wish he was more graceful like her mom's. And ultimately, she says she's happy with the way things are now because growing up, she didn't get that. I mean... I really get a better understanding now of McKelty's relationship with her dad, and it seems just as we all suspect it. She's choosing to have a relationship with him because she missed it growing up. She now can take the lead. She can actually form a great bond with him, something that she wasn't able to do when she was smaller. She also let us know that things between she and Robin aren't in the place where 
it used to be. She says that she does have contact with her dad, but Robin, she hasn't contacted her in a while, vice versa. She also says that she believes Robin is mourning and she's not in a good headspace. That's why Robin and her has not talked in a while. She was also asked a very great question that is in conjunction with the other statements about her dad and Robin. Someone asked, does she feel like Robin and Cody put as much effort into the relationship with her as she does to them? And she immediately says no. She says she is definitely putting in three times more effort to have a relationship with her dad and Robin than she is getting back from them. And I freaking knew that. I mean, we can see. In, even in the episodes, I know we're not in their homes. We don't live with them. We don't know what really goes on behind closed doors. But you can tell from the episodes. I mean, you don't ever hear Cody or Robin say, okay, we're going to make this trip to see McKelty today. Or we're going to go over there for one of the holidays and see her. I want to see the grandkids. No, you don't see that. You don't even hear really Cody saying great things about McKelty. All he said was, McKelty is very loyal to me. That's all he said. To me, it just looks very forced, and she kind of admitted that. I'm really sad that Cody pretty much only cares for Robin and her kids, and it's completely evident, and McKelty even says that during this recap. Everyone else is just kind of like, oh well. It's really sad, but let me know how you guys feel in the comment section below. I honestly feel like I'm happy that we're seeing a different perspective. I know... To a lot of people, McKelty can seem kind of like annoying and always defending her dad. But now that she's had this somewhat of a breakdown, I see where she's coming from. Um, her husband wasn't there to kind of like coach her or anything. And she was just really vulnerable and sharing her real feelings. And I honestly appreciate that coming from her. Um, am I the biggest fan of hers? Maybe I'm more drawn to her now than I was before just seeing how emotional and vulnerable she was so let me know how you guys feel in the comment section below don't forget to hit like and subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any updates bye for now